Hey there. Uh, today we're going to have a look at this pen. Uh, it came in a very colorful box and was sent to me by Navalure and this is the new Navalure Horizon. I think this is a very attractive pen uh, and it has a lot of features that I have been really enjoying. So, first of all, a very kind thank you to Navalure for sending me the pen. Uh, I will cover the parts of the pen, I will do a writing sample and I will tell you what I like about it and what I don't like about it. But look at the resin, it's very, very pretty. So, let's have fun with that. Let's start straight away. Okay, so here we go with this Navalure Horizon. Um, first thing I'll say is there are a lot of forest fires uh, currently going on, and as a result, the sky is veiled, and I had to use an external light. So I hope the lighting is, is somewhat okay. Um, here we go with this horizon. This is the box. I'll just open the box. Out comes this little inner box, and then uh, which can open up a little magnetic closure. Uh, we have this Navalure uh, how to fill your pen guide. Then there is the bed for the actual pen, and that's pretty much it. Let's look at, much more interestingly, the pen itself. Here we go, I'll zoom in. And then we have the pen right next to a Pilot Metropolitan. As you can see, it's a fairly large pen, and I will say, I think the, uh, the, the, the resin they use is very nice. There are four different types of resin available. It's a handmade resin, so you can pick one that you like. I really like this. Uh, the, the, the blue and orange, uh, I, I thought that that grade was, was very, very nice. Okay, what can I say about the pen? There's a couple of things that stand out. Uh, so a handmade resin, uh, what I really liked is this curved center band. I don't rec remember really seeing something like that. And then there's an ink window beneath that that I'll show you in just a second. Actual piston filler, so not captive converter, but an actual piston filler, uh, you get a... Um, a nice ink window, as I said. You can get nice nibs for these, fine, medium, broad, and stub. I like to see that, that range of nibs, that's really cool. You can pick whatever works best for you. They are steel nibs, they are number six. Uh, these are $168. Um, and, and that's pretty much all there's to it. So, let's look at the parts of the pen. On top of the pen we have this shiny, uh, yellow gold finial. We have the Navalure uh, clip, which always reminds me a little bit of a Triton. Uh, fits in with a nautical theme. I don't know if that's the idea, but that's what it reminds me of. Then we have the Navalure logo. Uh, we have this nice engraving on the wavy center band. We have the barrel, gold ring there, and the piston turning knob. The clip is tight, but very usable. And when we unscrew uh, the, the cap, uh, which, by the way, um, um, waves or not, the cap does stand up. I know that some people really care about these sorts of things, so there you go. Uh, ink window works very well, and what I really like is that you can see the ink window even when the pen, oops, sorry, when the pen is fully capped, you can see how much ink you have left, which is cool. We have the section. Section is straight, has threads at the end. I'll come back to that. Um, and then we have the number six nib with the Navalure, sorry, Navalure logo engraved in it uh, and the, uh, the feed. It's a nice pen, nice size I find, certainly a bit bigger uh, and it does post very securely too if you want to post and you have a really nice pen. Bit of metal there, makes it a little top heavy, but overall I think pretty nice. So, let's see how the pen writes. There was a hard start there. I have honestly not had any hard starts. I think that's just because I had the nib out for a bit. Uh, this is their broad nib. Um, Navalu also very kindly sent me a stub nib. Uh, I will show you that at some point. Not in this video though. I want to experiment a bit more with that. I've so far only used the broad nib to get to use the pen. Um, this is a uh, Con Pecky by Iro Shizuku. 
The writing experience with this nib is very, very pleasant. It's, I'm sorry for the hideous handwriting, I'm leaning on these threads, uh, sorry, these uh, rings here. I'll try harder. Very smooth, very pleasant, and importantly, consistent. I don't know why I'm doing this, I never do that, but pretty wet. Really nice, keeps up well with the ink flow. I've already done this, but nice and pretty wet. This really is a round broad nib, so there is no natural line variation. Um, always very careful. You could squeeze out a bit of line variation, but it's not a flex nib, right? If you want that, probably get the stub, and get some natural line variation. Uh, for those of you who enjoy such a thing, Reverse writing is po What do I like? What do I not like about the Navalure Horizon? There are a lot of things that I, I really like. I think the packaging is great. It's not excessive, but it's it's very colorful and I, I, I like the way Navalure did that. Um, with, I, I am a person that hates excessive packaging. We have ostentatious things that I don't keep all the pen packaging and I know that people balk at that but I, I, I don't so a lot of this is, is paper cardboard can be recycled etc I just like it it's 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 fun enough to to give you the impression that you've bought a fancy pen but it's not so excessive that you're stuck with a box the size of a house now <clears throat> About the pen itself, I think it's a beautiful pen. Uh, I, I, I really like this, this resin a lot. The way it grades in color, I think, is, is very, very nice. It's also, in my mind, a lovely size. A larger pen, without being excessively huge, uh, makes for a very nicely sized pen. It's a lovely writer. The broad nib is very pleasant, very smooth and has a very nice consistent ink flow, which I have enjoyed a lot. Uh, so that, that really is uh, as to its main function. After all, it's nice if a pen looks beautiful, but you buy it to write with, and it writes very, very nicely. So that is something I'm, I'm very, very happy with. I like the design, I like the ink window, and I really like that you can see the ink window even when the pen is capped. Um, I think that's that's very helpful because even without uncapping the pen, you know how much ink you have left, which I think is very very helpful. I also like that that wavy center band. It's kind of cool the way they've they've done that because I don't remember really seeing something like that uh, before. Uh, so I, I think that's another nice touch.